Hello everyone, welcome back. Um, as you can see by the title of this YouTube video, I'm going to take you through a day in my life as a D1 student athlete at the University of Oregon. Um, if you're not familiar with me, I'm Peyton Kuhn and I am a fifth year senior on the Oregon Acrobatics and Tumbling team and I'm also getting my masters in advertising and brand responsibility. So tonight is Sunday night and tomorrow, Monday, is a jam-packed day of weights, practice, COVID test, class, all the things that you guys want to see. So I'm going to walk you through. Um, I have to get up extremely early tomorrow for morning weights and so I'm about to go to bed and I will see you all in the morning. <laughs> I don't know if you can even hear me, but we are headed to get some breakfast at HDC. It's the student athlete. You can take this off now. It's dark, but it's a student athlete breakfast. And I'm headed there right now. just made it to Mouth United Arena. We had our lift at um, the Casanova Center, which is over by Austin, if you know where that is. Um, and it was really good, it was really hard. Um, but now I am waiting to go get a COVID test. Like we test and then we get the results right away. We do that Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. And then on Sunday we do the PCR, like full nose swab test. We do that because our sport is high contact. so. We're like literally touching each other. So basically it's like, you're not allowed to practice that day unless you had a negative COVID test. We're being really vigilant about testing, which is cool because um, Eugene or Lane County Public Health, which is like overseeing COVID stuff in Eugene, uh, they're kind of treating the athletic department as its own like city because even though there's a shutdown in Eugene right now, uh, we're still practicing and. Sorry, my nose is so itchy. Um, but we're still practicing and doing everything um, because we are so vigilant and we are, like every team is getting tested like so much. So it's kind of cool that we are still able to do that. I'm gonna sit here, enjoy my little breakfast. Um, yeah, let's see, we got, I already ate the bacon, and now it's just a bunch of potatoes and a bite of scrambled eggs. But I'll be eating this uh, while I wait, and yeah. That is so pretty. Oh my gosh, why does it keep doing that? Wow. All right, here we go. Let's get our nose swabbed. and my COVID test at like 8.15 and I took a shower and went back to bed and now it's 10.30 and I'm ready to restart my day again. This area um, is actually my roommate, Parsa. He is not home right now. Um, it's his room and he left before Thanksgiving and is not coming back for a while. So I've been using his room because he has a big desk as like my office workspace because our apartment doesn't really have, um, like our room doesn't have a door. It's kind of weird, but um, everything is really out in the open and it's nice to have like a closed office when he's not here. So 
I come in here and do my homework and do classes and whatnot. And then when he does come back, I'll probably just do it at the kitchen, um, the bar counter. But it just tends to get really loud in that living room area. So I'm doing it in here for now. So. Like I said, I just took a nap and I just woke up. Um, I don't have class till 2.15 and then right after class I have to head directly to practice because uh, class gets done at 3.45 and practice starts at 4 and we're actually supposed to be there 15 minutes early but I obviously have class so I have to literally run into practice. But right now before class I'm just going to work a little bit on getting organized for the week since it is a Monday. I'll probably fill out my planner. Um, I have to make some graphics. I do a lot of the Oregon Acrobatics and Tumbling Instagram graphics and story posts and things like that. So I'm gonna make a graphic for National Girls and Women in Sport Day. I have to finish up a graphic for a Motivation Monday series that we're doing. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do that right now and then prep for my class. Watch it. I'm gonna eat this lovely pre made wow. peanut and butter jelly. and jelly sandwich. Wow. You're so tall. Let Sorry. me, let me, yeah. Here, okay. let me just. I'll make it for you. Let me just, oh, you're gonna make me that? Well, we're making lunch now. What time is it? It is 1 09 in the afternoon. I prepped for my class by getting some assignments done and. By getting some assignments done and oh, beautiful plating skills. Now I'm gonna eat this peanut butter and jelly. So I'm just getting ready for practice before um, before my class starts because I don't have a lot of time in between my class and practice. Actually, I have literally no time. I just get done with class, turn off my Zoom, and drive straight to practice. So I always. Um, get fully dressed for practice before my class even starts. That class ran extremely long and now I am literally rushing out the door so that I can get to practice, hopefully on time. all of the COVID tests for my team came back negative because we didn't hear otherwise and which means we are having our first full team practice with being able to touch each other like actually do um, acros and pyramids and tosses which is majority of our sport so um, during the fall term we were pretty much only allowed to tumble because it was no contact and obviously we were six feet apart masked up no um, contact at all and we also were practicing in really small groups. I kind of forgot how big our team was. On Sunday we had our first team practice and there's uh, at least 39 or 40 of us and it's like practicing in groups of like 6 to 10. You forget how many people 40 is. Um, especially during COVID like I haven't been in a group of 40 people in like it feels like a year so um, yeah, it's really, really good to get the whole team back together and I'm super excited for our first practice. going to shower again really quick and then make dinner um, this is obviously much later but the rest of that night I just made dinner uh, watched some TV and chilled out um, and went to bed so I didn't really film much of it but I just want to say thank you so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed um, watching my day and I will see you next time <laughs>